creating a 3D logo in Adobe Illustrator CS6. Hello there. In this tutorial, we will learn how to create a 3D logo with Adobe Illustrator CS6. At first, we'll take the ellipse tool from the toolbox. Let's draw a circle pressing shift and select the color of the shape. Let's turn this stroke on from here. Keep the color of the stroke black. Now let's select the type tool. Let's type S. Let's transform it and place it in the middle of the circle. Let's enlarge it a little bit more. Now select both the items and align them. Now let's select the S and from object and expand and press OK. You see them got expanded. Now select both of them again and go to window and pathfinder. Then you see a pop-up right in this corner. Click here. Now you see our objects becoming like this. Now let's choose some color for the shape. Turn the stroke off. It looks good. Now select the shape again and go to Effect, 3D, Extrude and Bevel. You see there are a few options here. There are a few presets available here for the position. Now we will turn the preview on from here and go on to different presets. Front, Back, Left, and others to see what they are like. Even we can set the shape manually from here. So let's select front from here. Now from the perspective option, let's change it to our preference. Let's do it with 135 degree. Press OK. Now as you can see the shape kind of got some 3D look. Now select it again and from the object choose expand appearance. Now let's ungroup it right clicking on it. Now you see they got into smaller groups. Now let's do the coloring for this part. Now we want to give some gradient color too. Click on gradient, pressing alter, drag this color over here. Let's use the radial type. Now let's change the black to light green. So double clicking here, we change the color. Now for other areas of this part, we can customize the color as we like. Similarly, we can customize the color for this part as well.
Now let's select all of them and group them. Let's keep it aside. Now from the toolbox, grab the ellipse tool to draw another circle here. Let's give it a gradient color. Now select all of them and align vertically and after that click on the horizontal align center. You see automatically the circle sits on our design shape. Now right click on the top circle, go to arrange and choose send to back. Now if we enlarge it, you should notice that there are some bits and bobs to be fixed. Let's sort them out. So the logo is done. Let's reduce its size. Name it as support. Enlarge it. Justify it. Make it slightly smaller and change the color that goes with the logo. We can change the positions of them and make another version. So this is how we can create different 3D logos with the Illustrator. Thank you.